got the materials out to show you a quick gold leaf demonstration for applying gold leaf to a print. I'm gonna need to work fairly quickly on this. I've just rolled out a flat of black ink, which is gonna go underneath my gold foil. So this little thin sheet of gold foil is going to go face down so I can see the orange transfer sheet um, face down on my print. After the ink is dry, I will gently lift that away. The gold will stick to any wet ink. So uh, I wanna have an even coat on my block, but not so thick that it's excessively thick on the print. It should look just like my uh, black edition that I made earlier. My first step for doing the gold leaf is to evenly ink my block. And get a good print of my design. Then I want to quickly get my gold leaf applied. pressing in the middle and working my way out from the middle, trying to apply even pressure and avoid any air bubbles or portions of the foil that are not sticking to the ink. I'm gonna set that off to the side to make sure that it has time to dry. I have one more that I cut the gold foil to just cover the pepperonis on the design. So this one should be a black print with gold pepperonis. And again, I'm going to quickly get my gold leaf laid down, stuck down to the ink that I want the gold to stick to. I need to give this a good 15, 20 minutes to dry, and I'll come back and work with it once it's totally dry. So my prints are now dry to the touch. Uh, the ink is no longer tacky at all. I'm gonna begin by carefully peeling away the gold leaf sheet I should see something kind of like an outline and I can see the areas if I tilt this uh, that did get stuck down where the ink was and the areas where that gold leaf is a little bit loose. I can take a stiff bristle brush and go along the areas where the ink did not hold on to the gold and I'm going to brush those away. All these gold flakes can be dumped into the trash. I won't be able to really reuse those. And any fine little details, if I can't brush them out, I can use a needle tool or something uh, that will allow me to scrape a little bit and remove those finer details. I should see pretty much my print in gold. I want to repeat that same process for the pepperonis. So here are my two finished examples of gold leaf. One applied to a specific area of the print, the other applied to the general ink area of the print.